I'd like to take this minute to show you my solar powered uh, battery bank. This is the charge controller. This is the cigarette lighter attachment which I use to uh, charge my cell phone. I bought all my AA batteries. Uh, can run the small power inverter. If I open up the lid here, you can see inside. There's the alligator clips for the cigarette lighter attachment. USB there for charging small devices. Different than the other video, this is one of the terminals off the charge controller and this is the other. They should go across the bank from one end to the other. Same for using uh, the power. When you hook up your inverter you do one from one side of the battery bank and then one on the other side of the battery bank. I've added another 95 amp hour deep cycle marine battery to connect the batteries together. You're going to need a fairly heavy gauge cord if you're going to be drawing uh, large amounts at any given time, which my inverters do uh, up around four or five hundred amps. So um, I used an old booster cable. This is a piece of one where you can see the end of the wire has been a little bit tortured, so I didn't use that one in the circuit. But I cut a whole bunch about that length so I can daisy chain more batteries into the system. I essentially just twisted the ends of the wires together, put it onto the post in between two washers, and tightened it down. And uh, the washers have sandwiched down onto the copper wiring quite nicely. So I'm happy about the capability of high amps going through the batteries. Anyway, thank you YouTubers for watching. I'll close up my bench back up again. It looks better closed. Ventilation is just up here. This is where I can run the wires out from my inverters. I still don't have a permanent home for the inverters, so they come out when I need it, and they go away when I'm done. Thank you for watching. Bye.